Hello, my friends, and welcome back. It is Saturday, August 13th, 2022. Two, 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 twos. I'm the drunk poker of Tis Beer Time. I just woke up from a two hour outdoor nap. There's anything better than an outdoor nap on a sunny Saturday afternoon in August. I don't know what there is. So now it's time for beer. I didn't have any beer during the afternoon today before my nap because I'm like, I gotta, I gotta give a buddy a rest, man. Buddy had a good time last night. So here we are back again. Let's have some beers and talk about them and enjoy our vacation from our friends at Merritt Brewing. Got to see my pal Alicia today. Alicia, cheers to you. Merritt 107 Dortmunder 6.4% export lager. Dortmunder lager. What's a Dortmunder lager? Well, I looked it up because I like to know things. I enjoy knowledge. Knowledge is power and power is money and money is beer. That's how that works, right? It's 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 named after the region where it was, you know, Great in Dortmund, Germany. Uh, it's supposed to be kind of like a softer version of a pills, I guess, a pale lager. Um, sure, why not? I'll go. Made by Merit. It's going to be good. And I like these these higher ABV lagers because they tend to be a little more full bodied and they tend to have a little more oomph behind them. And I'm going to make it some more steak tonight. So lagers are, lagers are good with steak. I mean, I had IPA with steak last night, which is fine because I really spice the shit out of my steaks. But, you know, I like, I like a spicy, spicy. Spicy. But uh, yeah, so let's get into this. Uh, cheers to Merit. You know, guys, you know, I love you. Let's, let's get after that. I'm still like wiping sleep out of my eyes. This is awesome. Cheers. So let's put that in the beer plus category. Um, definitely, you do get that feeling of a softer body. Um, because usually with a, with a pill, you're like, oh, crisp and clean. This is softer. It feels maltier. It has a little bit more oomph to it. It has a little more character to it. It is a heavier feel to it. That's very nice. It has a little bit of low spice. That beer bitterness, which is fabulous. Great way to wake up, by the way. Great way to wake up. The first thing you have to drink is a beer. That's not weird at all. See, I'm not used to that. I get one day off, and then I have work days, and I get a day off. So I have split days off most, most of the time, 99% of the time. So I'm not used to, like, not preparing to go to work the next day. You know, I have my one night off, and the next day is like, okay, I'm working tomorrow. So this not having to work is really throwing me off. I'm not, I'm not used to it. It's, uh, it's been a while. It's a very nice, nice beer. A little bit sweeter than, say, a traditional pills would be, um, but much more in that kind of heavier, heavier, like a rewarding lager. Bring back the brew head. Bring him back. Bring him back. Come on back. Adam, we love you. Um, that's good. That's excellent. I, I think uh, I'm glad I picked up four. Well, three for me, one for Polly G. Gotta, gotta get beer for your friends. It's a nice thing to do, right? Okay, my friends, I'm out of here for now. I'll probably be back in a little while because I'm, I'm going to have more beers. I had a couple stops today, but uh, let's get into this. Cheers, my friends. Enjoy your afternoon. I sure know I am. quite lovely. Should be in your fridge. Then in your glass. Then in your belly. <laughs> 